Tensions today rose at the Kaduna Refinery, one of Nigeria's largest oil processing facilities, as women from the host town of Kapam in Chikundoku government area protested at the refinery's gate, blocking entry to the facility. The women, along with other town people, are demanding fast action, claiming that dangerous chemicals produced by the refinery are to blame for a number of distressing instances. The demonstrators claim that the chemical emissions are causing the deaths of their children, the withering of plants and deaths of animals in the community. With placards in hand, the women blocks the refinery's entrance, displaying proof of plant damage caused by the probable chemical exposure. They describe the hardships they experience on a daily basis while working under such conditions and they're asking the government to intervene immediately. Three days ago, when after releasing this their chemical, there is a farm, yam, yam farm that I collected loan to farm. I will take you people there to go and see the farm. I plant those yam in sap. If you go there, roughly 1,500 bags of yam. Now, this chemical just came upon the whole thing and it destroyed them in totality. Roughly 2 million. Nigeria makes bone known to me. Just to plant his crop. Everything, almost like 500 crop or that. It's got blight. Everything got blight. Please, just come and help us. Our woman beings, even some men, the women here, they're spent because of the chemicals. Even me, I have this, uh, I, I noticed it yesterday. My throat, I cannot swallow saliva because of the things that happened day before yesterday and yesterday. If you come to our farm, you will see how the things damage everywhere. Even my dog died yesterday because of this smelling. But the other man, we did. How many children are, are down? Gunmen attacked the Ogbaru local government area secretariat, destroying buildings and properties. The attack occurred in the early hours of today, and police authorities confirmed it. The state police public relations officer, SP Tochuku Ikenga, confirmed the attack and stated that a joint security operation was ongoing in the area. And this is not the first time Ogbaru local government headquarters has been attacked by gunmen with a previous attack causing damage to buildings and cars. Fingers have also always pointed at the secessionist element as the attackers. Meanwhile, Operation Well Punch troops killed eight bandits in Beningwari local government area of Kaduna State during a fighting patrol. The operation resulted in the recovery of arms, ammunition, and motorcycles. Seven bandits were neutralized in Kampanin Doka, including AK-47 rifles, magazines, mobile phones, radio sets, and civilian clothes. Another bandit was neutralized in Gayam, while others escaped with suspected gunshot wounds. Kaduna State Governor Senator Ubasani thanked the security forces for their efforts and urged citizens to report suspicious persons for treatment. Fighting patrols will continue in the general area and other locations of interest. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.